we're doing today, we're doing a What's Inside My Bag Hockey Edition. So many years ago, we did a What's Inside My Bag Baseball. All right, um, let's see what I got in here. So you don't get caught in the noggin. A bag of Doritos. Now, two years later, I believe, we're, we're gonna do a hockey edition. So to start off, in my bag, we've got the shoulder pads, power shoulder pads, just your regular needed equipment. Next up, we've got Tim Hortons and post birthday cake flavored cereal. You never know when you're gonna get hungry. You never know when you're gonna get peckish. Next up, we've got skates, test for skates, uh, just skates. Next up, we got the, the green biscuit, uh, made for practicing outside. And then we've got the film Will Ferrell's Anchorman. I think this is good because just in case the Zamboni breaks down, you can watch a movie with your buds and say, hey boys, you want to come over and watch Anchorman? It sounds good. And then we've got shortening. Shortening! We've got real shortening. This is actually shortening in here. Just in case, like, you know, like you get bored and you want to bake some muffins or some cookies, maybe. Or, like I said, if the Zamboni breaks down, you gotta wait for an extra hour or 30 minutes. You can bake with your buds. Now we've got tape, some Team Canada tape, or I guess just Canadian flag tape. I take pride in my country. Cologne. Uh, after a game, you smell pretty bad, pretty stinky and sweaty. So you really need that good spray cologne. Next up, we've got oh, toxic waste. Now these things are beautiful. These. Over what I call my low budget smelling salts. Toxic waste. It really wakes you up all the sourness. Next up we've got Oh yes, the water bottle. The good old water bottle and we got our dog on set. <laughs> no, maybe. Sorry about that. Um we've got a water bottle. Uh just gonna play against sports water bottle. Now we've got a bottle on it. Box of tin beams. An empty, this now an empty box of tin beams. A shoulder pad, or I guess, what is it, an elbow pad? Bower elbow pad? Now we've got a great big thing of coffee. This is actual coffee in here. here. Premium Arabica beans. In there. Next up, we've got the, uh, the gloves. Sherwood gloves got new Sherwood gloves, 12 inches. And last but not least, we've got the jock pants. And it also has got the jock inside, of course, with the dinky protector. Oh, remember the good times three years ago when I said that with the dinky protector? Roll the clip. With the dinky protector. Anyways, it's got the, the nut cup protector so you don't get hit in the coins with a puck. Towel, tape, laces, and more tape, and that, that, that's it. That's my bag. All right, thank you very much, Bo. That was a pretty interesting hockey bag you got there, but it is now my turn to show you guys what's in my hockey bag. So I'm gonna start off with some nice elbow guards. Um, these ones are really nice because they're kind of like a two-piece, you know, good flex, that sort of thing in hockey where there's one there's two so now I'm gonna move on to my next item I got a boxing glove you never know when things get rowdy you always want to have the upper hand a hockey glove is kind of stinky you want the nice boxing glove clock him in the face that's perfect next I got the good old brain protector the normal cage got the adjusting wheel on the back all right next got my inspiration it's the Stanley Cup we all have to start somewhere, right? Okay. Then next, we got the boot, the skate, with these nice skate guards on. Oh, this one isn't nice. Premium edges. Next up, we got a towel. You know, rub the sweat off your head, rub the snow off your skates. Next, this is very important. We have toilet candy. I use this as my pregame wake-up call. Next, 
we got a nice pair of blue hockey gloves. Um, in general, with my equipment, very colorful. I stand out quite a lot. Hustler. Next up, we got a recorder. Now, this recorder, this really hypes the boys up in the locker room. You know, a couple minutes before game time, let's say it's the final game, you go, Yo, boys! Really hypes everyone up. It's always good thing to have. Towel number two, got a lucky potato. Give it a good old rub. If you don't have a lucky potato, like I don't know what you're even doing. You could ask any professional hockey player, they'll have a lucky potato to rub before the game. And then we got two pucks, because coaches have a tendency of forgetting pucks when you go to practice. And last but not least, the ultimate hyping tool. We got the dog toy before games, even more so than the flute. You give one end to one of your teammates who's asleep, and the other end to someone who's not, he'll wake up to sleep, you got no problem. Dog toy's always a great thing to have. So that's gonna wrap it up for today's What's Inside My Bag video. What the heck is this? Oh my god! Bo? Hey, man. Bo's in my bag. No wonder it stinks so much. That took a turn. Why you in there, man? Alrighty then, that's gonna be it for the video. I guess we'll do the outro together. Bye guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Now you get to see what's in our hockey bag. Whether it's a lucky potato, a dog toy, whatever. Remember to, to subscribe, we will see you next time.